jumping. Yeah, there was a couple big fish jumping right off the front. Yeah. Yeah. The big ones are hard to catch, but pretty smart. <laughs> what kind of fish are they usually? Sea one, sea one brown, right? I'm not sure about each one, but I've never had it before. So, so. Oh. Like, they're nice to catch, take a fish, little fish I caught, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. <laughs> Like the one that got away, right? That's the run that got away. It was this big. It was huge. <laughs> hey folks, good chat with you. Yeah, yeah good chat with you. Thank you. We will for sure. But yeah, they'll be coming up to river. Like extra shallow here. It's low tide right now. You see, this is the plan. Yeah. What is up there? Your goal for today? Yeah. That's uh, it's a big goal for the day. <laughs> Yeah. They're coming up to spawn right now, right? Like, interesting. Yeah. yeah. So it's like our it's like our rainbow and browns and all our trout back home too. Yep, but these guys just so, big and aggressive. Yeah, they'll uh it's obviously like the ocean feed, so yep. they're they're almost like salmon. Yeah. So a lot of people actually prefer them over salmon, the sea runs. Mm -hmm. Obviously not the well, there's a there's a there's a big one right there. Okay. So oh, yeah. That? Yep. Yep. Yeah. yeah, right there. That's a nice fish, There's two of them. Yeah. That is a nice fish. Yeah, there's a big one there, and there's a smaller one that came out front here. How, how are you guys Right there. Him? Right off the orange glare. Watch, I'm gonna... He just moved. See him moving? He's right off the orange glare, right at the front of it here. Yeah, he's going that way now. <laughs> See, I'm from Ontario. I heard you guys say it. Yes, sir. A couple hours north of Toronto, up in the country. Nice. I lived in Aurora for four years, actually. In Aurora? Aurora. Yeah, King nice. City. Yeah. For school? Yeah, I went to St. Andrews College there. Oh, okay. Just prep school there, so. And you came back? Oh, yeah. I, I can't wait. There. No. <laughs> so, this is definitely a lot more what relaxed, part of man. What do you live in? Uh, I only live in the East End, so it's near Outer Cove, just down that way, probably 10 minutes. Nice. There's another one. I wish I had my fly rod right now. I didn't know. Yeah. Be. I actually just came down just to see what you know, was going on. A bit, but yeah. Now that I see him jumping out, I wish I had. <laughs> is there a hatch out right now? Is there an ad? There is no hatch out right now, though. I don't know what they're actually jumping for. Here it's mountain biking, downhill biking. No, for so, totally. So all of here is our, it's some of the best trails, all, like some of the best trails in Newfoundland. There's about, I'd say there's about 30 different trails from here going down to the ocean and yep. around the back. Mountain wow. bike? Yeah. And it, oh, and I wish I knew that. Oh, yeah, I'd come out and bring the... It's, well, it's not it's like, for the faint of heart. Unless like you, BC style, but it's, yeah. It's like... Extreme it's shit. It's extreme stuff. And it's actually really cool to walk through some of the trails as long as there's no, you know... People, yeah, fly. But <laughs> just looking at some of the features there, like it'll blow your mind. That's crazy. Huh. And it's natural too. A lot of the features and are rock faces and natural exactly, stuff. Exactly. Like, I'm saying, like if you look at our terrain, it's it's honestly perfect for it because it's you know. Yeah. Yeah, there's, yeah, there's so a bunch right there, babe. Let's see if the see if the tank comes okay. in here. There's, a, there's a couple. some more coming in. Yeah. And then you'll basically bike up around that hill, and it'll kind of take you like a. It's not a bad incline. You can bike all the way back up, and there's an old fisheries building up there. I should say old. They're still using it, but yeah. Fisheries building, and then. You can go backside or you can come up farther and i mean it's there's one jump line that's actually just over there it's called the janeway jump line and at the beginning of the trail like there's there's a there's two like crutches coming across and i mean you got 40 foot gaps in the woods oh, oh my god like, it's, it's absurd you weren't kidding about the fan <laughs> no, like bay, bay it's line, extreme the, the trail bay line is famous for its bus gaps they got a bus in between like <laughs> it's <gasps> wow. It's like you said, huge rock faces. Yeah. And one thing, the coolest, one of the coolest things that I've done this year, actually, first, the guy threw something. He was not Um, I got, I had two giant bluefin tuna hooked this year. Ooh. Oh, yeah. They were like 700, 800 pounds. <laughs> and the first one I had him on for 45 minutes, and he broke off. And then the last one I had him on, he was I was fighting for two and a half hours. Oh my God. And usually they say after 45 minutes, if you get past the 45 minute mark, yeah, he's he's good. Yeah. And I don't know what happened. He, he popped off. He actually came up and he seen the boat, and just the power and the strength of those things. Yeah. One big flick, I think, you know, his tail, but. Jeez. Yeah, was, That's wild. 
It's worth it's <laughs> worth waiting gold. That's why when Paul sent me that picture of the one that came into Petty Cove two weeks ago, and it's hanging there, and I'm like, that thing's worth a lot of money. Did you man. see it in person? He sent me a picture oh, of it. He walked down there and he's like, hey, he goes, just so you know, look what I'm down here this morning looking at him like, oh my God. Yeah, like this. I'm like, this thing's a monster. Oh God, there's four of you. Oh my God, hello everybody. Hello all of you. Oh my God. Oh, the girlfriend's gonna lose her mind when she comes out of the house. Hey everybody, Pets here. Just wanted to break into the video real quick and provide a little bit of context as to why we were just in the brewery and now standing in a stranger's laneway with their dogs. You gotta make sure you check out this video. I can't wait to go back there. We made friends for life out there. And we just want to share this with you. So make sure you hit the like and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one.